everyone. My name is Robin Geigel, and I am the author of By Way of Sorrow, which is out now on Kensington, and the forthcoming book, which will come out in January of 2022, Survivor's Guilt. I'd like to talk to you a little bit today about perseverance, because if nothing else, I am a, a study in perseverance. I started my first novel 40 years ago. So if you think, well, maybe I was five years old. No, I had graduated law school. I was a few years out of law school and I started that novel. I never completed that novel. Um, it was before I had come out as a transgender woman. I had a legal career that was taking off. Ultimately, we had three children and I got writer's block and that became my briefcase novel. It literally has sat in a briefcase for over 30 years. Fast forward to 2011 and I, at that point I had come out and I had transitioned and my children were grown and I was living on my own and that itch to write again came back. And so in 2011, I started a manuscript. I started a, another book fiction, obviously. Uh, and I finished that in 2014. And I started the process of looking for an agent, querying, you know, all that and getting all those rejection emails. And ultimately, I did get an agent. I was very fortunate. I have a wonderful agent, Carrie Pestrito. And she started chopping that book around. Well, while she was doing that, I said, well, what am I going to do with myself? So I started by way of sorrow. The book that Carrie was shopping around was never picked up. But about 100 pages into By Way of Sorrow, I sent it to, to Carrie and I said, you know, tell me what you think. And she responded by saying, I'm going to stop trying to sell this other manuscript because this one is much better. It's going to sell. And so I finished all the final drafts of, of By Way of Sorrow in September of 2018. And in December of 2018, I was very fortunate that By Way of Sorrow was picked up by Kensington Books. So my, my message to all of you is don't give up. Don't take all those rejections from your, your query letters and then when it's going out to publishers, don't take those as failures. They're, they're not failures. They're just other opportunities to grow and, and to, to take advantage of the opportunities, listen to the feedback that you're getting from people, your agent, your, your, the publishers, the editors that they're sending it out to, listen to that and be willing to accept that and try to make your, your work better. I think if I'm anything, you know, I, I'm a study, as I said, in perseverance. Here I am, 68 years old, with a debut novel and a second one on its way. So my message to you, is if I can do it, you can do it too.